Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a what's in my bag updated version because I realised the last time that I did this video was like more than a year ago. Obviously a year ago my circumstances were a lot different from now and my bag obviously the content has changed. So the bag that I have been wearing a lot lately is this ASOS one and it's a leather scallop edge bag and it's in like a tan brown colour. I got this from ASOS. I think it was about £70 which I think is quite a good price considering the quality is really good and it's quite a sturdy and um, nice leather bag. However I did get this about three months ago so I'm not entirely sure if they still have it on the website but I'll try to find it for you guys and link it down below so fingers crossed that I can find it and hopefully it might even be in the sale now. So my bag content is quite a large bag so it looks like that and I'm just going to pull random things out and show you guys what's inside. So the first thing I have is an umbrella and this is a leopard print one which I got from H&M and I believe it was only about £5 and I think that if you live in, in the UK or London or wherever in the UK then you have to have an umbrella at all times because the British weather is very unpredictable and one minute can be sunny and one minute can be just pouring cats and dogs so you kind of have to have an umbrella to um, just protect yourself if it does rain a hair clip and I have this black crocodile one which I can't remember where I got it from I think it was just from back home when I went home I also have a packet of tissues just in case I need a tissue to spit out gum or blow my nose or even if you go to public toilets and I don't have any um, toilet paper left I have some Neurofen Express which I think is the best painkiller ever and I always carry these in my bag because I'm always prone to headaches and I'm just a very weak person and if anybody was to catch a virus or get ill then I'm probably the first one to catch something. Um, I have this Kurt Geiger little envelope um, sippy bag which I've been keeping all my receipts in at the moment because I've been a lot of um, furniture shopping. I've got a lot of receipts and I'm trying to keep it all in here so it's nice and compact and I know where my receipts are. I also have my glasses with me at all times just in case my contacts get dry or I need to drive. Um, I find that wearing contacts when I'm driving is really uncomfortable so I just prefer to wear glasses and these are Chanel ones. I featured these on my blog before so if you want to um, check out what number or what serial number these are and you might be interested in buying the same pair then I'll link the um, blog post that I wrote down below and um, so that you can go directly and check that. I also have my iPhone and I have this Mac by Mac Jacobs cover on at the moment which I've got a lot of questions about especially on Instagram so yes it's Mac by Mac Jacobs and I got it in Selfridges. So because I'm always on my iPhone I have to carry a iPhone charger just because the battery is it's completely sucks and especially when you're on it all the time like Instagramming, going on Twitter, Facebook and um, I find that it runs out so quick and I always feel a bit lost when my battery has died on my iPhone so I always carry a charger with me now. I also have a back combing brush just to tease my hair or even just brush it when it needs brushing like probably now because it looks a bit frizzy but um, yeah so a back combing brush in my bag always. I have some oil blotting paper which I always go on about on other videos and you guys know that I love it so I always have those in my bag. I have a hand cream and I have the Sub and Glory hand food, the mini version so it's just easier to carry in my bag. I have the MAC blot powder and this is the medium shade and I use this um, when maybe my foundation is melting or it's sliding off and I need to just recover my face. I also have um, Dolly Wink eyelash glue always in my bag. Um, Rimmel red lip liner. MAC Smolder eye pencil. I also have the Collection 2000 Creme Puff Lip Cream in Fairy Cake. I also have a hair tie just in case I need to tie my hair. I have some tweezers to apply my false lashes with. Um, a very small 
bottle of perfume and this is the Versace crystal one and it's so tiny it's so cute this is like um, this is my hair tie and then this is the bottle so it's so cute um, I also have a lip balm by Kiehl's this is the Kiehl's uh, mango lip balm which is so yummy it smells so good I also have some biscuits I have some Ovaltine biscuits just in case I get hungry when I'm on the go so I always keep a bag of biscuits in my bag and these are yummy 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 I also have my wallet which is this Prada one and inside it's obviously just got all the basic like cards um, driving license, store cards, credit cards and just the usual pair stuff really and finally I have my camera which I always have in my bag and this is the one that I use to do Vlogmas with and I know I've got a lot of questions asking me what camera I used when I was doing Vlogmas and it's the Canon Ixus um, 240HS and I really like this camera because it's full HD and it's also got Wi-Fi so if I take a picture on here I can send it straight to my iPhone and upload it onto Instagram and that's really handy and for the price it's a really good quality camera and I would recommend it to anyone that's looking for a great compact camera. So that's the end of my what's in my bag video. I know I don't carry a lot or it might seem a lot to some of you guys but I've watched other what's in my bag um, videos and I I can't believe how, how much some people carry, carry. I think that if I was to carry that my arms would probably drop off. I'm quite a weakling. But yeah, so my bag is nice and empty now. And obviously it's quite big again. Again, I'm going to say this again. Again, how many times did I just say it again? But again, um, I'm going to praise this bag because I love it. And it's such a great, great bag. Especially for ASOS as well. Because um, this is probably my first leather bag from ASOS. And I am really impressed with the quality. So I would definitely recommend it to any of you guys. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. You've had a great new year so far. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I've had it for a few months now and it's um So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Hope you've had a new Hello? Why? I also have a hair tie just in case 